And listen, there's plenty more of uh, girls like that inside the bar. Take a pick, buddy. Thanks, buddy. I'm Johnny. <laughs> Old man Johnny. You say what? My name's Johnny. Old man Johnny. I'm going to go check her out Old there. Old man Johnny. Old man. He calls me, uh, everybody calls me Cowboy Draken. Cowboy Draken. I like it. Cowboy. I knew a cowboy once. He was a, he was a good lad. Oh, I'm going to get myself a beer. Thanks, boys. It's a great party. He's a good goner. He's a good gunner, but he's not he's so hot of a pilot. He's a goner. He's a goner. Hey, uh, oh, what's up? What do you guys do? We're talking about you in here. What are you guys all doing here and stuff? What are you guys up to in these days? You got your security guy over there? He's looking all dope. To get a, uh, we were trying to get a ship show started up over here, Grim Hex, but, uh, looks like nobody. Get down off the fucking bar. Around. That's a, that's a forceful voice. Good one. Are you ready in a Miss, you, off the bar, now! <laughs> Come on, baby. Talk to me. Come on, baby. That's it. Yeah, I'm going to pause it here for a second, because I want to take just a moment to set up the next stage of this. I can tell that these were not regular players to the verse. Right? The initial interaction was very different from most I hit, and they came off very much as social. Players. So I wanted to find out a little bit more about their background and how they engage in games. Um, we bonded over this really nicely. Like, they're fantastic people. And I'm really looking forward to this type of player coming more and more into the verse. As word spreads that the VoIP works really well in game and you can engage in this different type of social interaction in up to and including. Now this is 3.14, but in 3.15, you're gonna get drunk too. And all the side effects that come from that and the localized inventory and the rest of it, really starting to feel like an MMO coming together. It is going to attract more and more players like this. I am really looking forward to it. They were really fun to engage with. Let me crack this beer open. Oh boy, now this. This is the spot. We got glizzies on deck. We got beer on deck. Look at that view, Old too, right? Joe. Old man Joe, you the man. Old man Johnny, coming through for you, here for you. Old this is what I do. I got a question for you guys. Racetrack's where it's at. How you guys? How, how long you guys been around the verse anyway? Are you guys new to it or are you old? Oh, we're, we're still pretty, pretty old. new. Well, yeah, we're 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 in the middle, I'd say. We're like, uh, you know, still kind of new, but we've been here for a good minute. Good minute? That's good. I love it. I like that you guys are using the VoIP so much. It's just it's what I do. I go around, I talk to people, take them out at a good time, I show them what's going on, I show them the secrets that I know, like fucking hot dogs and beer. Dude, this, hot tubs. this right here, look, listen, man, it's, hey, bro. it's the little things that matter. It is. It is. New patch coming, so I'm gonna break character a little bit. You guys are gonna love 315. You can hide shit in your jackets now. You can put a fucking pistol in your goddamn pants pocket and stuff. It's great. It's oh, real good. That's and then when you kill me, you can take all my shit. On Buddy's head. Watch this. Yeah, and you can move the burgers and all that stuff. Oh my god, you did it! <laughs> you fucking did it! You fucking did it! I'm gonna try to balance, I'm gonna try to balance my beer bottle. <laughs> All right. Stay right there. So, so who's gonna go get a dragonfly with me and put a race on so you guys can watch this race in front of this motherfucker? Dragonfly races. Who's in? <laughs> Come on. I need another beer. Let's get some more beers. Let's get some money on the table too. Fifty thousand UEC. Fifty thousand. I'll bet. But fifty grand yes. right now. I need you to check your Facebook. Please. Fifty grand. Fifty grand for what? One race. One lap around. We'll do three laps. Okay. It's three laps. Life, right around. Just around, around Grim Hex, right? So we, we, about we start outside. Ship race. At dragonflies. Just a little, little the hover bikes. You can fly them in space. So we'll make our start right here, right, right by the keg. Right, we'll line up at the keg outside, and then three laps around. Whoever comes around wins, wins. And uh, this Chiquita here with the nice hair, the bun, right, looking all you know sophisticated yeah, and stuff. Yeah, yeah, she, yeah. She'll be our judge. She'll be the. So she'll call it. Corporal Scissor Sister. Scissor Sister. Oh, I love it. That's right. You want to be the judge? You're gonna call it. You're gonna stand right here and see 
Right here, this yeah, cake. Corporal, you, See? Can, you can be the judge of the race. Whoever passes the keg on the third lap wins. That we just lap around. That's fifty thousand credits on the line there. It's grand man. Grand. You guys have dragonflies? I only got one. Uh, I don't know. Do we? I think I know. I have a cyclone, but I don't have a dragonfly. Cyclone, yeah, yeah. You can you can take that one, but it pretty much guarantees me the win. Is uh, it does not work in space. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> I'm a sarcastic asshole too. I need a beer too, man. This is a good hangout. I just came in to chat with some people and see what was going on. Take you know a little video for like you know the YouTube and stuff. Hell yeah, this is the hangout right here, man. We're always doing this type of shit. Do you guys mind if I ask you another question though? Like, what type of gamers are you? I'm, I'm doing some stuff for a video, right? I'm just trying to drill into it. There's three type of buckets, basically. Single player, multiplayer, and PvP only. If you would put yourself in one of those buckets, what bucket would you put yourself in? I know this sounds like market research, but I do product management and stuff, so that's kind of what I do. You see, did you, what was the last one? PvP only? Yeah, so like Warzone and stuff like that, right? People who play exclusively those. Me personally, I am a large fan of Battle Royales, but I am, uh, I fuck with games like this, like ultra realistic, immersive games that you can, you know, really immerse yourself in. Me too. Like I'm a 5M, Red M, Star Citizen, you know, role playing shit like Day -Z. that. Yeah, Day Z. Day Z all the way for me. Day I came from Day Z. That's uh, where I came from. Hey, this game replaced Day Z for me because it's so much bigger, right? And there's so much more diversity. I, I meet people like this in DayZ, but you probably would have killed me and eat me, eat me by this point. So you know. <laughs> right. Have you? Uh, so what, yeah. Do you guys have like you're new, old, right? So have you guys do like a lot of PvP, a lot of flying? Are you guys like joystick flyers? Or? Hell no, I haven't done none of that yet. Oh boy, it's gonna be so good I've next. Done a batch. Bit of, I've done a little bit of PvP, but like I'm, by a little bit, I mean I think I've gotten into two dog fights with players. Okay, 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 okay. So do you guys like know uh like streamers to follow to learn flying? Avenger one's a really good one. Uh Moist Noodle's another good one on Twitch. I've been thinking about getting into those guys. Uh the Dark Law on YouTube too is another great one for flying. That guy is the low flying fucking king of Star Citizen. Like the guy's amazing. <laughs> Yeah, I got the. Dude, I, I've seen some videos of the. Uh, what do you know? Uh, Bad Bananas on uh, YouTube. No, but I'll check them out. I love Star Citizen yeah, content. Check Bad Bananas out, bro. His videos, great name. His his editing skills on his videos are fucking fantastic. He literally does perfect edits, and he makes his videos out to be like cinematic masterpieces. And it's all in Star Citizen. It's with him and his group friends. We have such good content creators. Dig that thirty two is another one. There's another guy, Leaf, that I follow. Strange creator, freaking nailed it on his. It's really funny too. He did one. Uh, yeah, man, I love this game for that. They showed off their director mode too, like the the CAIG, how they do their shorts. Man, I want them to give us access to that because they can do it all. Like they just lay it out, right? So good. I would love to do like a fucking like have a whole server uh all conjoined together working and making like a, a, a short uh, a little short action film or something out here. I'm gonna send you a friend request here. I wanna I wanna redo space above and beyond. Do you remember that show? Do you remember that? Yes, I, I want to redo that in the verse. We could do this five minute shorts, right? It's my goal to get that done. I love that show. It only got the one season, right? It got canceled. It was basically Wing Honestly, Commander. You, man, we have, we're currently in an organization with uh, these guys that we're with right now, and they have like 50 plus members. And yeah, if you want, we can send you a new book, man. We I love one. Easily or, we could easily organize something with the. Uh, with this organization have that many members awesome man check me out on youtube too i'm old man johnny morgan you have to search for me because i'm not named channel i'm just like old man johnny morgan old man johnny morgan yeah we came from my daisy days yeah was, my character in daisy was an old guy right that was a mechanic and we set up shot in cherno and me and a bunch of buddies it was great and we just we were known for building cars and boosting cars we stole a lot of cars <laughs> 
the car building system in DayZ was pretty cool. Yeah, it's really advanced now. I haven't played since like a while ago. I still follow Smoke in the Running Man. Smoke is great. I love that guy. He's like my style. Six. R6? No, but I think I've heard them. Smoke and, uh... Oh, shit. Scissor Scissor has glow sticks. Yeah! All right, so we get this race on? We don't have to put 50k up. Yeah, yeah. Anybody got a bike? What? And we got a dragonfly? A bike? Yeah, a dragonfly. I said, do you use those glow sticks on your other sisters? Did you say that, Star? That's how I mark my territory. Someone said you That's how I mark my territory. <laughs> I'm almost done my beer. Hold on, let me chug this real quick. Well, can you bring can you bring that over to Grim Hicks? Cause this guy's offering a fifty thousand dollars uh, race. Hey, race. Heifer, stay still. You can uh, you can spawn dragonflies here. He'll spawn here if you have one. Otherwise, you have to go to like uh, I think like Lowerville to buy them. I wonder if I can sit on your shoulder. Not yet. I think the collisions push you off. I love that it does that. It even <laughs> lets you do that. <laughs> I literally just like, I was like, ugh. <laughs> ugh. Ready? Oh! <laughs> I drank. It's all right. That was me. My bad. I had too many. I had too many. Oh, watch out, old man. Johnny got a little... Oh, shit. Johnny got the drip. Johnny got the drip. You guys got your racing gear, right? This is my racing gear. This is my racing outfit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me pop my racing gear on. Oh, my racing gear? I got you. <laughs> All right. Now, where's that window for the race? I think it's over here. Ah, uh, yeah. I gotta... Be... Maybe it's down below. Oh, shit. That's the beat. Oh! Oh! Oh. Oh no. <laughs> uh.